screen printing. The screen is in a frame set on a vacuum bed, so the vacuum keeps the paper down. The screen is a nylon with small little small gaps so the paint runs through. Put the paper in the plaster squares, then make sure it's flat down. The paint is a mixture of acrylic with medium. The texture should be cream cheese like. Put the ink on, spread it spread it thinly across, but make sure there's a lot of ink. Spread it across the whole part of the screen that you'll be putting the squeegee. Make sure to be holding the squeegee at a 45 degree angle when doing a screen and pull it tight. This is just a block screen which will print block colour and evenly. This is a negative stencil. Where the stencil is, it will be white. This is good for printing out things you want but make sure you get the cuts right. It's very specific as well. This one is a positive screen. Where the stencil isn't is where it prints. You can do two tone screens as well by splodging other inks on. This creates an interesting effect for backgrounds and also can create interesting designs and patterns. It also can give more depth and definition to your screen. Like so. Mixing different stencils together as well can work well. Now this is clearing up. Make sure to run water and soap through the screen very well to make sure it's completely clean.